Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm just here to try and touch on some the state of the game at the moment. And uh, I gotta say that it really doesn't pass for me. A lot of y'all know that I played last night uh, to uh, to record a video, and I, uh, once I uploaded that, I uh, I did get back on the game just to assess the situation to see how it was. I played for two or three hours. Um. It's kind of a mess right now. The server disconnects and, and you know, anybody who's played Red Dead knows about the server disconnects. They're, they've always been terrible. And they're still terrible. It's, uh, not even funny. Uh, next on the list is the, uh, the dry spell of content. There's really, like, nothing going on. Um, they did the bounty hunter role, you know, extension, but there really isn't much. A lot of people expected there to be much, much more. And, uh, ten ranks of the bounty hunter role, a new, oh, what, a new outfit, a new emote, some extra little things like that. That really wasn't what people were asking for. I know with the whole, you know, state of the world and the way things have been for the last year or so. There haven't been a lot of people in the offices. There's been, uh, you know, a lack of development happening for this and for GTA Online. I mean, the entire KO Perico heist update was, to the best of my understanding, made by developers at home. But aside from that, uh, aside from the server stability, the glitching and exploiting scene in this game is just obscene right now. It's crazy. I've seen people lag switching. I've seen people uh, killing others in safe zones, which is, you know, that's a glitch that's been around for literal months at this point. Uh, when I played the game six months ago, I was constantly being sniped out of my camp. That still happens. I was just lassoed out of my camp last night with the white flag up. Uh, I was killed in the post office uh, while I was checking my mail. I was killed uh, as I was going into the tailor. I mean, the safe zones basically are useless now. It, uh, if you're going up against someone who is griefing. Which seems to be even more people than there were last time I played the game. And that's unfortunate because I feel that Red Dead Online is a PvE-oriented game, but... Rockstar Games keeps shoveling PvP content down people's throats. As sad as that is, uh, that's just what the game is at the moment. It's a mess. Uh, Rockstar doesn't seem to be listening to feedback very well. Maybe not even at all. I haven't gotten any word back from my suggestions that I've added to their feedback link. I've sent some tickets into the support system and they just they basically don't respond. They'll, they'll respond to a ticket in you know two to three minutes which is absurd because the detail I put into a bug report or something like that is surreal. It takes a few minutes to process it. And they will uh, basically give me a cookie cutter response on telling me why they can't do anything to fix the issue. So, with the, between server stability, uh, the current dry spell, the exploit glitching situation, the whole um, Rockstar support really just being useless situation right now, I'd say the game is not worth playing right now unless you just you know really want to play Red Dead Online that's fine too I understand that there's a lot to do in the game you know, and it's really fun if you can look over uh, the problems yeah. but there are a lot of them so for me I would personally say if you've got something else to play play it because Red Dead is kind of a mess right now uh, other than that there's really not much else to say. They have been updating the game, but the updates are weekly stale. PvP adjustments, or two times on bounties this week, or, you know, typical Rockstar updates. There's really nothing to be said. 
And with all that out of the way, I think I'm going to go ahead and cut the video here because I feel like I've been rambling on some of these points. I'm going to go ahead and uh, probably just uninstall Red Dead Online and wait for them to fix the game so that it'll actually be enjoyable when I do decide to come back to it. Hopefully they'll add the character gender changes that I've been so adamantly <clears throat> fighting for. But I'm not sure that they will because at this point it doesn't seem like they listen to anybody. So we'll see. Anyways, uh, this has just been an update, you know, uh, on the state of the game from my perspective. Uh, some of you may disagree. Some of you may be, you know, have played the game for the last six months and you think things are good right now. That's fine. But as I see it, uh, this is <laughs> kind of a joke. Uh, being disconnected from a game frequently, it, that's not acceptable, especially for a AAA $60 um, game of the year, two years game. That's um, unacceptable. There are more resources that could have went into fixing this game and adjusting the game servers that aren't, and that's unfortunate. But I'm going to go ahead and close the video off here. So uh, you guys all take it easy and stay safe.